Hi Malaysia, my name is Shankar Gani Sridharan. I'm also called as Funky Shankar. This video is meant for Honorable Prime Minister of Malaysia, Tan Sri Mugidi. Firstly, I would like to thank our Prime Minister for putting the Malaysian's life as the first priority against anything else. And I would also like to thank all the medical staffs who are working day and night to save all the Malaysians. Thank you and I salute all of you. Dear Prime Minister, I humbly request you to watch this video because I would like to give you my opinions and I would like to also give you some suggestions in behalf of the Malaysians and the voiceless. Please kindly watch this video and I humbly request the entire Malaysians, you could be a Chinese, Malay, Indian or any race, share this video. Let's work together as Malaysians, letting go all our ego and pride. Dear Prime Minister, we understand coronavirus COVID-19 has caused many deaths and has infected many people around the world. We also know that Malaysians have been infected with this coronavirus and the numbers are increasing day by day. And that's the reason you have implemented for the Malaysians to stay in their home for their safety. And this 14 days order could extend up to April 15. And now the most important thing, I would like you to understand something, Prime Minister. Firstly, there's shortage of food supply. A lot of people do not have food. In fact, the poor, they don't have food at all. The homeless don't even have a roof. And all these things are important factors that need to be looked into. And I don't see anything being done. So please kindly understand that the food supply needs to be worked out. Dear Prime Minister, you must understand the fact that a lot of people are doing private business. Their sole survival is on this daily income. Since they are told right now to stay at home under this protection order, how are they going to survive? How are they going to pay their bills? There are a couple of people who have been told by their companies to take unpaid leave. How are they going to pay their bills end of the month? And how are they going to survive? This is all a question mark. Social media is a very big platform. A lot of people are watching news across the nation. And when they see other country leaders are providing their citizens with necessities, it becomes a big question mark to Malaysians. I want you to understand that we need to improve the system and the benefits and the necessities to be given to the Malaysians. Dear Prime Minister, I hope you understand that Malaysians have a lot of commitments end of the month. They have their mortgage loan, they have their car loan, they have the electricity bill, water bill, insurance, mobile, telephone, blah, blah. Oh my goodness, there's so much bills to be paid. And due to this situation, how are these people are going to pay their bills? So please, Prime Minister, do something about this. Either give them a discount or extend this payment to a later date. Give them a breather, please. Sir, there's a lot of people who wants to do volunteer work like me and many others. We are ready to help the government fight this coronavirus together with you. How are we going to do this? Call in the volunteers district by district together with the medical team. Hold the device, go home by home and check whether people are infected with coronavirus or not. I'm ready. I believe a lot of people are ready to help fight coronavirus together with the government. There's a lot of people who are serving their sentence under PCO. Their only request is, could we be with our parents? It's been very long. We're just afraid, you know, anything could happen since the numbers are increasing. So I humbly request the Prime Minister to give them a second chance and let them be with their parents. I hope so. Please, please, sir. I know it's a big request, but I hope you can do this. Dear Prime Minister, I hope you watch this video. And I hope that you could implement on these ideas and uh, do something for the Malaysians. I know you can do it. I know you are a good leader and you can definitely do the best for the Malaysians. And I also want to clap for all the Malaysians who have been following the rules and regulation by staying at home and creating awareness to the public. Salute to all Malaysians and I hope you share this video as much as you can. And I hope you can tag our Prime Minister of Malaysia. Thank you. God bless everybody.